Welcome to the 2014 spring semester. I want to go over a few things to help you understand how we're using Blackboard. So just so you get a picture on how faculty are enrolled in Blackboard, is once your academic dean sends down your name uh, to the registrar, uh, the registrar will add your name into the uh, computer system. Every morning at about 5.30, an enrollment file is created for faculty and students. And on Monday through Friday, uh, when the school is open, um, the, our first priority is to upload that file to Blackboard. So a good rule of thumb is once you see your name uh, in the queue in the faculty schedule, uh, within 24 hours, you should have access to your Blackboard course. Another thing we're doing is we're making short uh, YouTube videos if you are unable to come into the Center for Academic Excellence and attend a Blackboard uh, workshop. Uh, we have some videos that you can watch anytime um, on how to log into Blackboard, how to get into your course and upload a file, how to take attendance uh, in Blackboard, and also how to access uh, some video tutorials by Atomic Learning. After you've logged into the queue, on the faculty welcome page, you can scroll down and look for My Faculty Tools. And in this section, you will find your faculty schedule, where you can click and see for the session that's listed. Um, so I have spring 2014. You would see that the courses that you're in the registrar's database. Within 24 hours, you know, the next business day, Monday through Friday, you will be enrolled into your Blackboard course. Next, we will log into Blackboard by clicking on the Blackboard icon from the faculty welcome page. Here, you'll be directed to the Welcome tab in the My Welcome page. From this page, you will look for your My Courses module. I've grouped mine by term, where you can watch this video tutorial, Organizing My Courses module. I've moved the Spring 14 semester to the top, and I can see the courses where I'm an instructor, the name. Uh, this unavailable will be available Tuesday, January 21st. Uh, that's unavailable for student users. Uh, faculty users uh, can hover over the name and you'll see the link. You can click into your course. Once you've clicked inside your course, you will want to make sure that the edit mode is on so that you can make changes inside your course shell if you would like to. Uh, you can remove, hide, uh, rename any of these pages, and you can add content uh, to these different pages uh, for your course. Good luck with the spring 2014 semester. You can always email help at qcc.mass.edu with technical questions about Blackboard.